Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento, a mid-afternoon update for TFNN. Well, it's mostly green today, folks. Uh, well, the NASDAQ just went uh, negative. We got the S&P still up about 11. The Dow is up about 120. Uh, we've got Treasury bonds and Treasury notes up slightly. The U.S. dollar has been strengthening, uh, as we talked about uh, on our show yesterday. Uh, crude oil is up slightly. Uh, gold is about unchanged, and silver is up about 10 cents. A very quiet day, considering the fact that we had this incredible move in some of these stocks here on Monday and Tuesday. And I might add, much to my surprise. Now, two things possibly happened that I've got this thing totally wrong. Are off by two days. That I don't know, but no one knows that either. But all I said in the videos that I send out is, look, we tried this once. It didn't work. We have to wait for the secondary signal if we get one, and then we'll take a look at it. I'm not going to chase this market to the upside. This has all the earmarks of a blow-off move on any stretch of the imagination. But, folks, it has been very, very impressive, and I will stand corrected because uh, in the dot-com bubble, uh, we had a move that I thought was going to be uh, pretty substantial. It backed off just a little bit and it went up for another nine months. And uh, we were actually uh, buying stuff, uh, not commodity stuff, not related to, uh, to stocks, but it turned out to be a big move. So this could be a life-changing move, but I don't believe that it is. We'll have to wait and see. As a matter of fact, today is the first day we've seen a little bit of divergence because the Dow, which has been the leader, uh, has been well the Nasdaq has been leading too but uh, it did not make a new high on this last rally high about an hour ago whether that means much or not I'm not sure but what we're looking at is shorter term patterns in order to protect our risk and keep us in the game so that when this big move comes that yes we will be on it I'm not worried about that at all we've caught some of these and we're going to continue to keep them one other market to pay really close attention to folks that we've been talking about here at TFNN has been the natural gas uh, today we made a 61 percent retracement up there at 265 we're slightly lower than that right now but it's taken several days to get here which is a sign uh, maybe the market is not nearly as strong gold wait folks we still got a chance for some much lower prices in gold but we'll know about that very shortly. Stay tuned, folks. I got a great announcement for us. Live every day in an attitude of gratitude and may God bless. We'll see you in about three minutes.